Hello YouTube, this is Wheelchair21 and this is a Figure Arts review for Common Rider 4's Module Set 1. And Module Set 1 comes with four module set module pieces. Uh you got first your launcher leg with special missile missiles and kind of cool boot style legging. Uh where you would plug into the bottom of his, his regular foot and then into his leg. Uh the missiles somehow do come out, but I don't know how you pull them out, or at least the tips out, to make it look like they're firing. The other one is his radar arm, which folds down. There, you can see the joint right in here. You have to put the hand on to before attaching it to his forearm. The thing that goes down. And you also have his camera arm for his left arm. And this one has no really articulation, except this nice little glass thing to make it look like a real camera. Uh, lens and the thing to view it with, you know. And then finally, everyone's original first switch, most likely, if you bought the O's, O's, uh, Burakwani set, Magic Hand, which has a joint here, joints in the claw, rotates 360, a joint here, another joint here, and they all spin, each joint spins about Three, ah, wait, each joint spins about 360, 360, it can go all 360, every joint. Um, all these pieces do go to attached to fours, figure art, which I do have on me, which is not in view, now it is. Uh, the easiest way to display this is because you have to keep taking off hands and putting hands on, the best way is always use your spare extra hands that come with fours for the time being. And just easily plugging them in. Don't have to restart this video. And your magic hand. Let's get that on. <clears throat> Pulling off the arm. Little joint here. Plugs right back in. Easy as so. Uh, gotta lift that up. And here's your magic hand. The magic hand, uh, I think you need a Tamashi stage for because, as you can see, it's really freaking huge and will overweigh him, in a sense. Boom, see? There's no real way, unless you get the legs nice and firmly planted. Somehow do. You have to have him, like, in this lengthy, weird look. I don't know. Um, the issue is, as I noticed, it is the magic hand will need a Tomshi stage. So, yeah, because it either weighs down the body, or it just makes him top-heavy because of the uh, balancing issue. Uh, I would not preferably pose him with this arm, Unless you're doing still frame animation. This is really long for the fact that it goes at least a good... Uh, it at least goes about 6 inches. It's at least 6 inches, 7 inches maybe. From uh, from the forearm all the way to the claw. Uh, I still gotta say, it's not one of my favorite switches to display. So far, it's probably one of the worst switch ideas to display with. The arm just pops on easily. It's not that hard to pop these in and off. Uh, okay. That was the magic hand. I gotta say, all these are nicely detailed. Uh, I, I don't think there's much missing on the magic hand, nor I think there is really missing on the camera, but I could be wrong. I've not re really witnessed the camera in action as much. I think it's one of the least used switches, because it is probably one of the crappiest switches out there. Uh, so I'm just gonna quickly grab another hand out. Um, I think this one's gonna look a lot better than the magic hand. I, I, I really think so. I mean... Anything's better than magic hand, and this goes on the left hand, so I gotta loosen this joint. It has the same as the other arm. Just plug it back in, as so. You got your camera hand to do some filming with, you know. It's filming you, filming me. I don't know, it's one of these oxymorons, paradox things. It's recording me as I'm recording you. Cool. Um, I mean, this is pretty bland of a review. I mean, all it is is just displaying. I mean, all these are are really good display pieces to complete the series. I mean, probably the, um, uh, what would you call it, module series for uh, fours is probably a whole lot better to play around with, I guess, than these figure arts because they do have really tight peg joints here. So I'm always afraid of the breaking or cracking. And, uh, I, I think you're supposed to use the fist hand if you want to, uh, bring the satellite down. 
because it does have like this nice little chip piece to show where the knuckle will stop at if the like right about here there's a little dot for the plastic molding and the hand goes on really as easy for when he wants to talk to uh, all of his buddies back at the base but recently they haven't been at the base they've been all out strolling around going oh no what's going on what are we doing who's this new guy meteor he's pretty badass he thinks he's Bruce Lee um I gotta say, all these modules are kind of not really worth buying except for launcher and radar. Because if you think about it, all you need are these two. And they gave you kind of two useless ones, the camera and the magic hand. I mean, not that great. Uh, I, I gotta say, if you really want this, get it if you're a huge Force fan, if you're a huge of all fan of the modules. But I gotta say, so far, it's not really worth the buy. Um, just for two switch pieces for like twenty dollars, and to pull the leg out, it's similar like the drill leg. So once you get the leg off, all you gotta do is quickly unscrew his foot from the leg, which pops out as so. To get it back on, you pop it right back in the joint, and this one right here, and you just shove that down and in. Once you got that in, you got your launcher leg. And to get your launcher leg back on, you just plug the joint back into the hole. So I'm going to take that off screen real fast to plug this into here. And here we go, launcher leg with fours. Uh, launcher leg with fours is probably one of my favorite modules so far released, uh, other than the rocket one, since it does come with the figure. Uh, I can't wait to see what the other ones come with. It looks really nice with them all on, like the ones that he uses in the show, mostly. Uh, I really don't enjoy, like I say, these ones. And for like the $20 price to get it, it's not really worth it for just two foot. I mean, it all depends on what you like and what you prefer in the show to be more show accurate, more commonly used. Uh, it's cool that they're probably going to release all 40 switches. It's switches slash modules. It's not really worth the buy unless it gives you a better onslaught of good ones. I mean, he has a lot of poor ones along with a lot of very good ones and useful ones. It all depends on what's your taste and likes. Uh, I, I do say, though, if you really uh, enjoy it, I, I don't knock you from getting it. Uh, probably from now on, I'm probably just going to do uh, module sets when uh, other figures comes out. So, like, with elect states, I'll probably just use it with that, or just using it with base states. Um, it'd probably be an easier review if you just actually save a whole bunch and still shop them and just talk while you're doing still frame picks instead of going through the display because all you gotta do is pull off the you know for the calves or whatever you gotta pull off the forearms and you pretty much got your forwards going on and you just gotta pull off your feet you put on plug in your arms and that's one of the issues i gotta say about these things is you gotta plug in the hand then you gotta plug in the forearm or you gotta pull off the leg pull out the foot replace it boom 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 and it's all and you go through about a total of eight steps by doing each limb if you want to do a giant com combination. So it's like, oh, hey, I want to put on, say, uh, rocket. Rocket, boom. Rocket, that's one easy one. But then you want to put on, say, maybe radar. Boom, that's two more. And say you want to put Gatling on when Gatling comes out. That's two more. That's now five. So, I mean, you really want to have patience and be careful because uh, so far there is a few things you need to know is as well as the, these joints being slightly loose, but not totally lo loose like O's was, when his arms and like his head was all bobbling about, he will have some slight tight areas like on his joints to pop them off, and probably in his hips. So very, I must say, be careful, be safe, and hopefully you don't break anything. Uh, this has been Wheelchair 21. This is the Common Rider 4's Module Set 1 review, and we'll review display... Uh, whatever you want to call it, and I hope you enjoy it. I hope this at least gives you some ideas of what you're looking at, what you hope to get, or what you probably don't want. Uh, like I said, check out my reviews, check out my vlogs, check out my blog, check out Annie X Toku, check out Toku Anime News, check out their blogs, and see what you like. So this has been so. All I gotta say is bye.